Okay, so today we are doing a Joe Fresh review, and we have some things to discuss about. Okay, which one's yours? Oh, this one's mine because it's just from the package. So, number one, Joe Kabuki. Yes, both of us Probably, have it. Probably, we, we, this is the only brush from Joe that we have, but it's so soft. So soft. How much was it? $12. $12. Okay, this thing is $12. Just this little kabuki. If you See? look at, um, if you know the, the, uh, brand Quo at Shoppers Drug Mart, it's like $25. So that's pretty good. And this is so soft. Honestly, um, she had this first. She was just yeah. like, because I really wanted a kabuki. Because I really wanted a kabuki, and I was in Loblaws, and I saw it, and I was like, Yeah. Perfect. Joe Fresh, by the way, is available at Real Canadian Superstore Loblaws. Mm -hmm. Okay, so this, like, out of 10 stars, like, 10. It's yeah. freaking amazing. Amazing. Definitely oh. recommended. Okay. This is a um, liquid eyeliner, and it's like a pencil. Um, I know that Lancome has something like this, and it's really good. Um, mine's, like, older, so it's really, so it just goes, just goes on. Like that, look. Look at that. So easy to apply. And it's just, like, a pen, so it's, like, really small. I know CoverGirl has something like this, but it's very small, so it's hard to control. So it's pretty good? Yeah, it's very good. Okay, um... I actually bought, because when you're doing your lashes, you always want to prime them. So then you have something that the mascara will lengthen out and go by. And I actually needed um, a mascara primer. And this is how it looks like. This is just the brush here. Okay, it's it's a pretty good brush, you know. And it's 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 a clear mascara. And I found it to be a pretty good primer because I found that with this, it separated and lengthened my lashes, so then that means that the mascara wasn't clumpy. Now, they say that this is a both a clear mascara and a brow gel, but I think I would probably buy two separate ones because, like, like you, this is this is a whole different part of your face from your eyelashes. Mm -hmm. Eyelashes are the most delicate. Like, eyebrows, I would probably, like, I'm not sure if I it's would It's probably use not these. very clean to use it for both. Also, recommendation don't use it after you apply mascara because it completely, all the black gets in here. So really when you're priming your lashes or ne yeah, never. you want to go for a natural effect, it'll just put on black. Number one rule, never, we repeat, never, ever, ever use any primer over your mascara. Yeah. If you hear someone say that, no. Your, your mascara is going to clog up. Bacteria mm -hmm. is going into the little tunnel or the little tube, and it's just, Into no. here. No, not at all. Okay. So another thing, um, I talked about this in the haul, but this is a an eyeshadow, and it's in Gold Rush, and it's really, really beautiful. And um, how I apply it is right underneath your lashes on the side, um, and it just makes your eyes appear brighter. Such good quality. The pigmentation is amazing on that. Thing. Definitely. We're probably gonna do. We're probably gonna do like a Joe Fresh look, because it's really really cheap. This was four dollars. Four dollars. Four dollars. Taxes for this. like. I like, think this was like around that same price, five dollars maybe. And honestly, the quality is amazing. The, the the number one thing why we wanted to do review on this is because of the quality. Like, like the problem is with drugstore, you never know what you're gonna get. Sometimes mascara. Like, there is a Revlon, um, which one is it? It's red, and it has, like, four parts. Like, here's the... Is it, it a lip gloss, like, or... No, no, like, mascara. The one that you have. Oh! Revlon Double Take. No! It clumps so much. So much. No, because man. Because it's all spiky. The, uh, the one spiky good one... The spiky one that I really recommend is CoverGirl. Oh my god, CoverGirl Lash Blast. Lash Blast. Like, Anything CoverGirl is good. Really good. Just no to Revlon Double Twist mm -hmm. Mascara. Mm -hmm. No. Just, ugh. Anyways, back to Joe Fresh. Okay, then I have two more eye pencils. These 
we can't really compare these to NYX, NYX Jumbo Eye Pencils because we haven't tried the NYX Jumbo Eye Pencils. Next. But from other people that we see here on YouTube, it's really good. So we don't have NYX at in Canada. And so this is just kind of like a alternative. alternative. And so, But they're really good. And they're just like an, a nice eyeshadow. This is one of the colors. And this is the other, right in between the black. See, you can't really see them. We'll probably do, like, another, like, uh, makeup. We'll probably do a look with these two. Let um, The quality is really good, though. Like, it's like, like a, for blending. It's like a light pink. For blending, it's really good. Like, we're blending it right now. And I'm sure if you really wanted, you could use it on your lips because it's very, like, creamy. creamy. But, but, like, not that creamy. It's like a lip pencil. You know how sometimes you, for, like, example, a red lip. You color your lips in, and Red then you put, like, <laughs> you color your lips in, and then you put um, a gloss over, and it looks like a lipstick. It looks amazing, and it really stays So definitely on. recommend these. Joe Fresh Stuff. Kabukis. Eyeshadow and Gold Rush. Eyeshadow pencils. Eyeliner. And clear mascara. Don't use this on your brows. That's a whole different thing. Buy two of these if you want to. Yep. Yeah. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this. Go okay. to Joe. Bye-bye.